PD-100 Black Hornet. What at first glance might appear to be a toy drone is actually the smallest military drone in the world. Its tiny size, combined with its exceptional performance, has made the PD-100 Black Hornet a nearly perfect recognition device. Its advantages have already been recognized by British troops during their operations in Afghanistan. In addition, these miniature drones have been acquired by the United States and 17 other countries. But why are they so good? Firstly, the drone doesn't need to be assembled. It can be put into operation in just a few seconds. The controls are very simple, and learning to operate it takes no more than 20 minutes. The drone weighs only 18 grams, and it's 16 centimeters long. At the same time, it's silent, has three cameras, and is able to move away from the operator as far as 1.6 kilometers. It can be controlled even with one hand, using a special remote control. The battery provides up to 25 minutes of work. The information is delivered to the operator in real time as well. The drone itself doesn't store information, which is useful in case of capture. The PD-100 Black Hornet is very maneuverable too. The night vision system and the thermal camera improve recognition tasks. The drone's not affected by bad weather like rain or snow. It can easily withstand winds of 8 to 12 meters per second, and its maximum speed is 18 kilometers per hour. GuardBot If you need a ground-based recognition device, the best option is GuardBot. This device also has compact dimensions. Its diameter is only 60 centimeters, but don't be fooled by its fragile appearance. GuardBot can travel by both water and land. The engineers have given the device a high level of cross-country ability, so it moves just as smoothly and easily over grass, sand, snow, and other rough surfaces. The purpose of this unmanned robot surveillance sphere is to patrol territories, detect explosive devices, and dangerous chemicals. Cameras inside the robot provide a 360-degree view. A microphone records everything that's happening around the robot. The data is also transmitted in real time through secure data channels. The guard bot weighs 24 kilograms. It can operate continuously for four to six hours and at a speed of up to 10 kilometers per hour on land. On water, the speed is five kilometers per hour. iRobot PackBot 510 Now let's talk about a popular military robot actively used by the US military in Iraq and Afghanistan. The device was created by the American company iRobot, involved in the US Army's modernization program. The advantages of the design are pretty obvious. The PackBot 510 robot uses caterpillar tracks to move. However, they have a special mobile design. Thanks to it, the robot can self-propel, descend safely, and overcome even large obstacles. But that's not all. This robot has an advantage that other reconnaissance vehicles we've mentioned today do not have. It can be equipped with a two meter long robotic arm. It has a flexible design so that the camera mounted at the end can penetrate even inaccessible areas. The mechanical clamp increases the number of tasks the robot can perform. The device can reach speeds of up to 24 kilometers per hour and weighs 29 kilograms. Themis UGV Here we have an amazing unmanned ground robot that, in addition to performing intelligence missions, can participate in combat operations too. This equipment is produced by the company Milrim Robotics from Estonia. The robot's name stands for Tracked Hybrid Modular Infantry System, while UGV stands for Unmanned Ground Vehicle. But let's talk about its features. The robot is equipped with a 40mm grenade launcher and a 12.7mm machine gun. The operator controls the movements of the device and the remotely launched projectiles using a device that looks like a tablet. 
the developers have tried to make the control intuitive and simple, which reduces operator fatigue and improves efficiency. The manufacturer also provided protection. The body of the robot can withstand shots from armor-piercing weapons and anti-tank mine explosions. The built-in flying drone, which can be launched using the control panel, provides a better all-round view. The maximum speed of the robot is 24 km per hour, but this shortcoming is compensated by its high cross-country ability. Themis UGV can easily deal with 60 degree grades and water up to 61 centimeters deep. Dogo this tactical combat robot was developed by the Israeli company General Robotics. Its mission is to provide armed support to the infantry during anti-terrorist operations, as well as other combat operations. The device has many advantages. Firstly, its compact size. The weight of the robot doesn't exceed 12 kilograms, so it's easy to transport from one place to another. Nine built-in micro-cameras are responsible for the recognition functions and provide a 360-degree view. But the most important feature is the 9mm Glock combat pistol with 14 cartridges that can be installed inside. This feature distinguishes the robot from all others because the robot was designed specifically for this weapon and can only be used with it. Other similar robots are designed for interchangeable combat modules. Among other things, Dogo stands out for its maneuverability, its ability to overcome obstacles thanks to its track system, and even to climb stairs. The integrated battery guarantees four hours of continuous operation. TICAT the developers of this device were inspired by the idea that soon there will be no people on the battlefields. Battles will be fought between machines controlled by operators from a safe distance. TICAD is a battle drone that will easily replace a full human combat team. It can perform various tasks many times faster and much more efficiently. So what is TICAT? This system has been developed by a team of American specialists from Duke Robotics. The drone is equipped with small arms, making it ideal for anti-terrorist operations. TICAT is particularly relevant when the battle takes place near populated areas. Engineers are confident that the use of these drones will reduce civilian casualties. The advantage of the drone is that it's capable of lifting almost any weapon into the air. The only limit is the weight. It shouldn't exceed 10 kilograms. For now, TICAD only follows the operator's orders. However, we wouldn't be surprised if in the future, these systems could discover the enemy and open fire on their own. Sea Wasp Today, we've shown you devices designed for recognition in the air, on the ground, and on the water. However, there's another field we haven't mentioned – underwater space. The Sea Wasp is a robot for countering underwater improvised explosive devices developed by the Swedish company Saab. As you can guess from this description, the device was designed to safely search, move, and diffuse explosive devices underwater. The model was introduced in 2016. You should know that until recently, the deactivation of underwater explosives was done by divers because there was simply no other option. That's why the Sea Wasp is a very important development. This drone is powered by two electric motors, allowing it to reach speeds of up to 15 km per hour. Hey, stop being lazy, it's time to use that brain of yours. Welcome to Brain Time. Incredible facts from the past, the present, and even the future. The power of nature and wild animals. Amazing facts and unsolved mysteries. You'll find all this and much more here. Subscribe now, you won't regret it.